Hello, my name is Phil Nix. I'm the team commander for the Trauma Critical Care Team, part of the National Disaster Medical System, uh, United States Department of Health and Human Services. And our teams here in Palau to augment their Ministry of Health vaccination pod here at the National Gymnasium. So the Trauma Critical Care Team is made up of over 200 uh, both clinical and non-clinical personnel, uh, including uh, physicians, uh, PAs, nurse practitioners, nurses, paramedics, respiratory therapists, and our uh, non-medical support personnel that um, respond to public health emergencies, uh, you know, natural disasters, uh, that sort of thing. Um, the past uh, year, we've been extremely busy on the other line, uh, the other side of COVID, actually taking care of, of critically ill uh, COVID patients uh, in the mainland U.S. hospitals that were completely overwhelmed. You know, this is one of the probably very few, if only if the only place on earth uh, that is COVID free. Um, we, we know that the efficacy of this vaccine is extremely effective. Uh, I, based on my hometown community, uh, we've already seen in the last two weeks a decrease of 25% uh, in COVID cases and positively rates. Uh, and that, that ju that's just amazing. So to have the opportunity to come here, uh, administer the vaccine, and actually you know, play a part in helping keeping Palau COVID free uh, is, is very uh, worthwhile and uh, very gratifying. Administering the vaccine here uh, and achieving uh, you know, pretty close to over 80% uh, vaccination of this country uh, will uh, establish herd immunity here. It will keep people safe, and this is the prime example why everybody else in the world really needs uh, to become vaccinated. It really does work, and uh, you know this 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 country will will prove that to the rest of the world that it does work, and it will keep Palau safe. One pretty uh, unique uh, aspect of our team is we're all intermittent federal employees. Uh, we're all active clinically in our own uh, jobs uh, back home in the U.S. and our team covers, uh, you know, every state in the United States. I have people from east to west, north, north to south. So they all make the sacrifice of, you know, breaking away from their families and their jobs to come here and uh, serve the United States, represent the United States and, and, uh, and these quite successful missions and, and really making an impact on um, health and in this case global health.